Hello everyone, today's video is an updated version of what I am doing. First of all, I'd like to tell the game developers what the hell happened to our supports. Like, after this kitten release, all supports are kind of useless. It's, it's, it's probably just, you know, mostly the Pagoda, mostly, no, you know what, both supports. Both supports are all dead. Cause like now, if you, if you use a kitten and a rabbit, and you're stro a little stronger than the person you're fighting, it's an easy win. It's an easy win. Cause most of the time, the other person has one tank. One person fights, you know, the one tank fights that one person, and then the other uh, back row dealer just fucking wipes the floor with all the supports and then it's just an unbalanced fight because now you're fighting a whole team with you know, no supports and you made your whole lineup based off that support that is exactly why i switched to tiger and bear i'm gonna show you my auras i'm gonna show you my bear more in depth and then we're probably just gonna end it there okay my kitten, it's not the kind of kitten that you see with other kittens. That's why I haven't dropped a video yet. I'll tell you why in this video, why I made my kitten the way I made my kitten. If you don't like it, then obviously you can go and go on my Discord, talk to someone. They'll show you the traditional um, high DPS kitten. My kitten's more of a uh, DPS support in a sense. <laughs> I'll show you why. Stay tuned. Subscribe like the video join the discord we will now start adding in more games so if you play other games drop that in the comment section i'll get on those make sure that we have videos for you um all right enjoy so into the auras my mace is kind of the same still nothing really changed still have those uh you know two defensive auras that you know help increase my health regen the other one is just uh debuff uh resistant and if you haven't seen my mace video definitely go check that out because i really haven't changed anything with it it's still that same kind of uh, pl uh player that i had back then my tiger is also the same i haven't changed anything with that all i did was add this hardened body which increases the block rate, which allows that tiger blood to activate more. Right? So there you have it. That's with my tiger. And then um, with the... There's something else that I did with my tiger, actually. So go to mounts. I told you I've been working on it. This is what I've been putting most of my shards in. So down here, you see this block rate? I am doing that all the time. Now that I have it all the way there. Yeah, I kind of feel like i wasted a lot of shards but it's so worth it i'm going to put this up to 60 just so that i can increase this block rate as much as possible okay so um that's just i don't know one thing that i've been doing that i haven't really been telling anyone um but yeah so back to the auras with my bear i'll, I'll do my bear last i'll do my bear last all right so i just want to show these auras so I know in my rapid video it was a little unclear. I have a source fury, vicious strikes, fracture, X robust, uh, shadow strike, heavy suplex, crest dance, dragon soul, glass cannon, core strength. And I told you I built this. If you watch that video, I did build this kind of kind of like my mace. It's not exactly like my mace because it doesn't have an ability in a sense that you know regens, but it has a talent that regens which is okay as well so that's my uh rabbit and my rabbit's usually the second person to go after my bear just to give you that as well um so yeah so uh we'll do the kitten first so i have nether realm blast and phantom all those generals and uh possession which isn't what people use they like using pierce they like using claw they like using all that other stuff for that for that single as much uh single target damage or uh dps as possible and i uh, i'm okay with that i see it work but for me i feel like if this whole story is about my mace this is the best way to go 
because in the talents you'll see that it um i think it boosts the damage the basic attack damage and a couple of other things and maybe some debuffs and passive uh passive debuff that i like as well because that just allows my my mace to thrive and if you see my mace is the highest cp and it's what all of my fighting is for like all these tanks all the, the rabbit all that is just preparing the battle for my mace so i think it's a great idea for me um i haven't seen any flaws yet and as soon as i see anything change in the game i go straight to you guys and tell you guys what it is but so far i feel like this is the best way to build your your lineup if you're free to play because you go against the meta you go against the meta and i feel like you are a meta i feel like this is the meta for free to play if you see a guy who's spending a whole ton of money don't look at his build the reason why is because he can easily go and grab every single resource that he needs to boost all his characters to be as high a cp as he wants and he probably has mounts that you will never see the day of um so um that give him crazy uh stat bonuses and all that stuff so don't look at that they're, they're, they're all right so if you want to watch someone who's like you know like constantly like looking at someone who's ahead of him someone who's above him and constantly fighting those fights and changing his lineup here and there just to beat that one person that's who you should be watching like that's what i do like I, i'll go and fight the top 15 top 20 and if i see something that's different something that i feel like i should i could fix like that's how i got to those um resistant debuffs that's how i got to this lineup right here so that's why i say do this i'm not gonna force anyone to do this because you know obviously like i don't want to like cause anything for you to go bad like you could probably try to do this and then you you probably forgot one thing or i probably left something out and then you know now you're like oh man like why did he tell me to do this or maybe you're just impatient and you don't want to wait and i'm like dude like this took time so um it is what i feel like is the best 100 that's what i feel but it takes time so definitely definitely check this out now with my bear with my bear i have these auras okay so i still build him straight up defensive and um weakening the enemy and then for my talents for my talents i have these right here i'll show i'll show you those right now aura and general so that's what i have right now okay tell me what you think tell me if you tried it tell me if um there's anything you feel like i should do even though i probably won't listen because i like i like learning my learning for my for it myself like i like figuring things out i like beating people that are way stronger than me i find joy in that that's why i give you guys this so that you guys don't run into the problems that i ran into and you can start fresh and do things the right way now if you if you feel like your supports are lacking just, just do it just do it for you guys for, for the ones who really feel that way just do it it's i'm talking this is for the people who are just like in love with their teals or in love with their uh, their uh pagodas this, this is for them this is really for them that i'm saying like okay i don't want to destroy what you got going but this is what i think i am dropping new uh videos about other games and that is on my discord so there is a ch channel now for other games so go in there feel free to feel free to go there um stay stay tuned for all that so yeah subscribe um Tell me what you think about the video down below. Um, and thank you guys. I really appreciate everything you guys have done for me. Um, viewing and subscribing. Like, that really means a lot to me. Alright. So, I'll see you guys later.